Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I will discuss about nuclear cell model and some important problem about it which is important for net gate examination and it will also helpful for those students who are preparing for CPT 2020 examination. So please see this video very carefully. In nuclear cell model at first I discuss about order of cell. So the order of cell is like 1s up 1p 3 by 2, 1p half, 1p 5 by 2, 2s half, 1d 3 by 2, 1f 7 by 2, dot dot like that. And this is the nuclear number 2, 4, 2, 6, 2, 4, 8, dot dot. And half 3 by 2, half 5 by 2, half 3 by 2, 7 by 2, dot dot. This is the spin value. Now I discuss spin parity prediction so there are mainly three type of nuclei one is even even nuclei another is even odd nuclei or odd even nuclei and third one is odd odd nuclei so even even nuclei means if proton number and neutron number both are even um, that is called even even nuclei suppose for example 8 or 16 here proton number is 8 also neutron number also 8 so this is one even even nuclei so for even even nuclei they have no unpaired nuclei thus the parity is positive and angular momentum is zero so spin parity is zero plus now for even odd nuclei or odd even nuclei the angular momentum will be decided by last unpaired electron and the parity we can calculate using this rule minus 1 whole to the power L. So for proton it is LP and for neutron it is LN. And for odd odd nuclei, if the angular momentum of proton, angular momentum of neutron and the value of proton, L value of proton and L value of neutron is odd number, odd number, then total angular momentum j equal to jp plus jn and for order nuclei if jp plus jn plus lp plus ln which is even number so then total angular momentum j equal to we can write jp minus jn and parity always it is minus 1 whole to the power lp plus ln that rule you must remember exceptional case you always remember for 9 f 19 the spin parity is half plus and for 11 n 23 spin parity is 3 by 2 plus and for 25 m n 55 spin parity is 5 by 2 minus these three are exceptional case now I discuss some important problem of nuclear cell model. Uh, first problem from GATE 2019, the nuclear spin and parity of 20 CA40 in the ground state is 0 plus, 0 minus, 1 plus, 1 minus. So here it is given 20 CA40, that means proton number is 20 and neutron number is also 40 minus 20 means 20. So it is a even even nuclei. So they have no unpaired nuclei, thus the parity is positive and angular momentum is zero. So without any calculation, we can write the spin parity value is zero plus. That means option A is correct. Next problem, in the nuclear cell model, the spin parity of 7N15 is given by half minus half plus 3 by 2 minus 3 by 2 plus. So here given 7 n 15 that means proton number is 7 and neutron number is 15 minus 7 that means 8. So here we, we know the spin parity relation 1 has half 1 p 3 by 2 1 p half. So first one is 2 4 2 that means 4 5 6 7 8 that means the value of 
spin is half and it is in p so l is 1 so we can write parity is minus 1 whole to the power l that means minus 1 whole to the power 1 so it is minus 1 so the spin parity of 7 and 15 is half minus 1 that means on option 1 is correct thank you